This is Tom Dillon, the Lifetime Liberal. Today is Thursday, June 7th, 2018. The title of this rant is A Summer of Discontent. Uh, constitutional riots abound. So this summer, a lot will be going on and there will be a tremendous amount of distraction from this administration as to the real things that are going on. And we need to be wary that it is done specifically to distract us. So we have an unnecessary trade war. It isn't about terrible trade deals with the United States. It's the fact that we are actually uh, uh, putting tariffs on our allies on negotiated agreements that we've had saying that this is national security interest when it's not national security interest at all. And our allies are retaliating against us going after, I'm just going to name three, soybeans, bourbon, and motorcycles because those are things in red states that will hurt red states. So um, this is a made up stupid thing. We also have an extremely illogical summit meeting uh, with North Korea, where the U.S. is basically uh, uh, giving a global recognition of the Hermit Kingdom with no concessions whatsoever. Why the hell are we doing that? Uh, denuclearization will take decades. Uh, and, you know, you could come out with a wave of paper. Yeah, we got them to agree, just like Chamberlain did in 1938, uh, when it isn't worth the paper that it's written on. Uh, because there's going to, like I said, it's got to be years and years of hard fought things to make that happen. Again, uh, to keep us away from the most important things that are going on. The Russia Gate is just like the universe. It's expanding, uh, and it is a legitimate investigation to criminal activity by Russians uh, uh, who were attacking our sovereignty during our election. Uh, and it was done in conjunction with the help of the Trump administration, uh, Trump cronies outside of the administration, and other entities. Um, and they were doing it strictly so Trump could get elected. Now, there will be indictments uh, and there will be prison time. And this investigation needs to continue and it will go very deep. Uh, the other thing is that the Democrats did extremely well in Tuesday's primary election in a number of different states. OK, look for the Republicans uh, who are running this fall to slowly and continually disengage from the from, from the, uh, the president, uh, the president will and they will use that too. Att used culture wars because they don't have anything to run on. The tax, the only thing they had was taxes, and no one's no one. They're not going to run on taxes. They're going to run on MS-13. They're going to run on the NFL. Uh, and uh, again, it's racial. Uh, it's fear-based, and it's not going to work but they think it's going to work and what are the democrats going to do they're going to be running on a positive message as to where the united states can go progressive message on need to increase infrastructure need to take care of health care need to address the opioid crisis need to to address firearm safety issues increases in education must deal with the environment those are the positive issues but everything that you're going to be here coming out from this administration is going to strictly uh, be designed to basically distract you from these main issues. And it is done because they have nothing to run on. And this administration is in deep constitutional, deep legal, and deep political shit. And the resistance must continue.